How do you feel about your group going into Saturday night's game? I feel pretty good. I'm excited yeah. for them. You know, they've worked hard. A lot of these guys, they came here for this game. And, you know, it's a game that we've looked forward to since the end of last season. It didn't end the way we wanted to, even though we fought hard. But uh, this is another challenge for us. And, you know, we got some good leadership. I think we're, I think we'll be ready. You just heard Coach Ward say they might have the best offensive line in the country. Is that, you know, that type of thing fire up your guys? Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, if you're a competitor, it does. And, and I think I got some competitors. So um, you know, I think those guys have had this game. You know, I signed guys based off of this game. They wanted to come and play against Alabama. So uh, they're going to get what they want. LD, when you, you talked about signing the class you guys did in you know, your position, bigger, stronger, faster guys like the Wyatt Wicked. Part of it was before this game, and obviously for you know, being the ones down the road. Are those guys ready? And they're newcomers, so they're going to be new. But do you feel like they're ready to go up against a team like this? They're new to college football, and they're new to this defense. So there's going to be a, a learning curve there. But what we're trying to get them focused on is, is playing hard and compete. You know, that's the way we practice every day. That's the way our program is built. they got to come out and compete. You know, It doesn't matter who we're playing. We understand the challenge that this team presents. And, uh, like I said, those guys came here because they wanted that challenge, so they're going to get it. You didn't have a ton of bodies last year. You got more this year. Do you expect a fluid rotation? I mean, I guess will it take a little time for you to get down how you want to rotate guys? Absolutely. We'll have to, you know, like I said, these guys are new to our program and new to this defense, so we're still finding out what they can do, you know, and, and that's going to show in the first game. That's going to show over the course of the season. But, uh, you know, we'll, we'll definitely have way more depth than we had last year. Uh, you know, that was a, a, a big recruiting emphasis for us. So, you know, I'm really confident that we have the number of bodies to go out there and stop the run and, and, and be competitive for four quarters. You said earlier during camps that John was the only guy who had locked down a spot on the defensive line. Have more guys it's kind of show, impressed you with what they've shown and, and secured those spots? Uh, yeah, we have been impressed by some guys. You know, I think Big Diz has, has shown us that he can be a force, you know, in, in the run game and, and hard to move. We have some other guys that are, that are long, talented, athletic. You know, they're still young. They're still mm -hmm. a little bit raw, but you know, the, the talent is there. We just got to get you know get the best out of them. And this game is going to be great for them. You mentioned that you guys have signed players based off this game. Puma seems to be looking forward to it. He seems to be, you know, seems to like the challenge. It, did, does that strike you about him at all? Well, I recruited Puma. Right. And, uh, you know, it, it came down to us and Alabama. So yeah. you know, I'm. Uh, I'm sure he's very excited about this challenge. He knows exactly what their program is built on. So um, yeah, I'm excited for him. You know, he's waited his turn, and I think he's ready. I'm excited to see how he, go play, how he goes to play. What kind of problems does Damian Harris present to the defense? He's one of the best backs in the country. You know, he, he's got a, a great set of skills. He's got great speed for that, that size and that power, and, and he's a really, really good player. You, know, you, don't, you don't see many guys like him. But we, we faced some really good backs, and you know, we've had our, our opportunities. So I think our guys understand the challenge that he presents. And, and it's kind of like Coach Ward said, we, we better all understand it's going to take all of us to get that guy down for four quarters every single play. You know, it's not one minute's job. Alabama's got the, the two different quarterbacks that are vying for that spot. Does preparing for either one of them, you know, is that a challenge for you guys, or just be preparing for a mobile quarterback? How's that work? Um, I think we're just preparing for playing as fast as we can, the most sound football we can in the defense that we have. You know, we're, we're still a young defense, you know, as far as experience goes. Um, we've only been running this defense for, you know, eight months. So we're continuing to get better at what we do. You know, the quarterback, you know, he'll throw the ball and he'll run the ball, either or guy. They'll, they'll both be very similar. And their offense is their offense. You know, they're gonna, we know what they're going to do. They know what they're going to do. They're going to control the ball. They're going to run the quarterback. You know, take their deep shots. So you know, the, the, the actual guy doesn't matter as much as, as everyone's making it out to be. Do you expect to play a lot of the guys that you expect to play? Like you said earlier on the camp, do you expect to, 10 guys to play? I mean, could we see a lot of those guys play in Alabama, try to stop the run, or is it just going to be a pretty consistent rotation? We're going, we're going to see a lot of guys playing. Coach, uh, Coach Ward's from – Went to Alabama, obviously. You're from Auburn. Does that add, add any emotion to this one for you? Um, not really, except for I just I know what this type of game is about. Yeah. I know what their program is built on. I know what SEC football is all about. Coming from uh, Arkansas and, and playing Auburn a couple yeah. of years ago, we 
we understand this is going to be a line of scrimmage game on both sides of the ball. And if you're not prepared there, it's going to be a long day. So we're making sure that we're going to be prepared to do that. All right. Thanks.